In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make a button activator. First thing you want to do is change the data type to 16 bit. It's a specific value equal. Now, each button has a value. Like, button up on the D-pad, its value is 0008 down 0, 0, 0, 4, and so on and so on with all these buttons. <clears throat> so to find the address that holds the values of the button, you would need to go to 16-bit, specific value, equal. Just put in the value of the button, which is 0, 0, 0, 4, which corresponds to down, as shown here, so, hold down down on the D-pad on the Wii Remote, search. You have to hold the button down. If you don't hold it down, it will not work. So, hold the button down and wait for the search to finish. There we go. Now, since we have 344 pages, we want to lower it down. Change the value to something else. Uh, we want to make it, it can be anything you want. Let's make the value B. So now, Enter the value for B, which is 0, 4, 0, 0. Hold down B and hit refine. down at 22 results. Let's lower it down even more. Let's do up, which is zero. My bad, let's do A, which is zero, eight, zero, zero. Hold down A, and we're fine again. Down 20 results. So let's look at the top result. Right click, memory viewer, auto update. Hold down, up on the D pad. It shows the value, which corresponds to up, left, button value that corresponds to left, that B, A. Remember, Make sure you hold it down to be sure the value doesn't change. So we found the button activator address. Right click, new GCT code, name it what you want. And button tutorial. And I think I spelled tutorial wrong. But anyway, change the code type from 02 to 28. Now, let's make it so whenever we touch or hold down plus on the Wii Remote, it will activate. So change this to 10. And that is your button activator. 
you can put this value into calculator hex zero zero ten hit not get FFEF put that in front of it and it'll make it a little more accurate so FFEF that'll make it Act more accurate. That's how you make a button activator. I'll show you how to make it more advanced in ASM in a later tutorial. Thank you.